In this video, we will be looking at standard alignment of frames. Always use the correct tools. Avoid trying to use your hands alone as they are not fine or strong enough to make most of these adjustments. You can also hurt yourself if you don't use the proper tools. Check your tools before you begin. Inspect the plastic fibre jaw pliers to make sure that they're smooth. When adjusting plastic frames, you'll mainly use frame heaters. When adjusting metal frames, you'll mainly use the appropriate set of pliers and occasionally frame heaters. Take special care when adjusting rimless frames. Use special rimless pliers to support the lenses and their plugs and to reduce the strain on these during the adjustment. The rest of the steps that follow are the same for adjusting all frame types. Only the tools used will differ. To place any frame into standard alignment, you need to complete nine steps in the following order. The order is very important as you must start at the frame front and work your way back to the temple ends. Check that the horizontal alignment and bow of the frame front are level and at the same angle. Here you can see that the contour of the frame front has a gentle and consistent bow. Look for two possible errors. Is the bridge twisted? This is known as Xing because it causes the eye rims to form an X when viewed from the side. This needs to be straightened. Also look down onto the frame from above. If the lens planes aren't parallel, one will sit further forward than the other. Make sure you align the frames so that they sit equally in the same plane. Look at the angles that the fully open temples make with the frame front. These should each make an angle of about 95 degrees or just past perpendicular to the frame front when opened. Realign the letback angles if necessary. This is also known as temple parallelism. Check this from the side or get a side view to see what angles the temples make with the frame front or pantoscopic tilt. These angles must be the same. If they're not, they must be fixed. The alignment now moves towards the rear of the temples for the temple turned down or angled down. These need to be the same length and angle to one another. If they're not, fix the misaligned temple bends. To check if the temples are parallel and the correct angle down, see if they rest evenly on a flat surface. If correctly aligned, the frame front and open temples will both touch the flat surface evenly, causing a four-point touch. When closed, the temples should fold so that they are parallel to one another or form slight angles. These angles should be equal and should cross in the centre of the frame or directly behind the centre of the bridge. Open and close the temples and feel whether these are loose or tight. Check that they can open and close with relative ease. Use a screwdriver to adjust the joint screws if necessary. Finally, take another good look or overview the frame. It should look evenly balanced from every aspect. Also, make sure that it's clean.